graduation day. I just finished getting ready. I curled my hair. I put this dress on, but I'm not really feeling it. So I'm going to go to the store and see if I can find a dress. It's honestly not the best idea. Wait till the day of the event to buy a dress. We're gonna go to the store. Hopefully you can find something cute. Cause honestly, I'm just not really feeling this dress. So we headed to the store and I didn't really like this dress at all. I didn't like the fit. It fit me terribly. It was baggy. This one was an option. It was okay. It was like a second choice if I liked one of the other ones. This one I felt like was a bit too businessy and not really right for the grad occasion. But this next dress is one that I am obsessed with. This was my favorite. I definitely bought this one because it fit me perfectly. It was a bodycon which I've never worn before but I felt so confident in it and I loved this dress. So this is what I ended up choosing because it just looked so good. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a little graduation vlog because today is my very last day of high school, I guess you could say. I have one project to finish and then I'm done. It's so crazy to me that four years ago I started grade nine and I was just this puny little grade nine who didn't know anything. And now I'm literally like graduating high school, going on to college, that's so weird to me. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Let's get on to the graduation celebration because it's gonna be so much fun and I'm so excited to just celebrate being done school. It's kind of weird to me, but also kind of fun and crazy. So I hope you guys like this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below to become a member of this channel. We're at 385 now, which is insane. We're literally so close to 400 and I'm so excited to be growing so definitely stay till the end of this video watch the whole video through it's gonna be such a fun vlog also follow me on all my socials they'll be in the description box below turn on the bell notification you guys know the drill so this is the dress that I found this was my favorite one it's like a bodycon black dress but it kind of has a high neck so I just paired it with the Shein butterfly necklace and I think it looks super cute. It doesn't go too long on me, which I really like because I am short, as you guys know. So I hate when my dresses go up, but I think I'm gonna go take pictures like by myself in my dress in the backyard because my mom put a few decorations out. A few moments later. Okay, so we just finished taking pictures. They actually turned out really good. So I have so many photos to go through. I also wanted to mention that I posted a new video. So if you guys haven't seen it yet definitely make sure to go see it it's a who knows me better out of my best friend and my sister so if you haven't seen this video yet definitely go watch it it's saying there we go I think I'm gonna update my Instagram story to say like happy graduation or something but I also wanted to show you guys the sign that I received as a gift don't mind the mess on my dresser right now I need to clean it but this sign is so cool it says class of 2020 and then my name which i think is so cool it's glass and i'm really excited to have it to remember my graduation i'm going to update my instagram story because i really like to post on there so if you want to follow it go follow it this is the instagram story i posted i just put a little cute little sticker 2020 grad took a little mirror selfie with my brand new mirror again there's mess everywhere but i got this mirror very recently and it will be in a video soon to come so make sure to subscribe for that two hours later hey guys um it's victoria caitlin's driving so look ridiculous yeah so she just got back from taking photos with some of her friends and we're going to go pick up mom and dad i have to go to my school pick up my certificate it's not my actual diploma 
you have to pick up like a certificate so i have to go and do that yeah. and then we're having a barbecue tonight a few moments later okay so this next clip is me getting my graduation certificate which is crazy to me that i actually graduated but that's besides the point right now i'm just so grateful that my school was able to hold somewhat of a graduation to remember the class of 2020 so thank you to my school for what you did put together because honestly i didn't think i was getting a graduation at all so i'm very excited that you guys were able to put something good together because I was very sad when I found out my graduation was going to be cancelled, but I'm very thankful and grateful for what was put together. Much, much, much later. Sorry I haven't really vlogged today. We had snacks and dinner all very quickly. It was pretty chaotic and things just were like going on. Like a lot was going on. And I kind of failed at vlogging today. I know there's a virtual like, I don't even know, ceremony I think it is that I have to attend at 7 if I want to obviously. I kind of wanted to go swimming but it's really cold. Also kind of wanted to work out today because it just makes my body like feel good to move. It's kind of been a crazy day. I do need to finish schoolwork. That is my last thing to do before I'm officially done with high school is I just have to finish my one project but I don't know what else I'm gonna get up to. So hopefully I can do a better job at vlogging now that there's less people. I just wanted to spend some family time and just have some fun and not really worry about the camera. You guys will see me finish my high school. Like I'm done. I spent four years there and it's kind of crazy that I'm literally going to be done in like a few hours once I get my project done. So that's actually kind of crazy and it's kind of really weird. The fact that I went to a place for four years straight and now I'm just never have to go back there again never have to wear the uniform again it's kind of crazy and weird and life is just moving so fast and it's just making me realize that i really need to appreciate everything so i decided to paint my nails so i'm going to be painting them this white it's literally just white but i changed for my dress because it's actually really cold super excited because i haven't painted my nails in like a week and i hate you guys know i hate when my nails are not painted so i'm gonna paint them I just painted them white. I'm not very good at painting nails, so they look a little ratchet if you can even tell up close. They're not very good because also with this thumb one broke. Now it looks even worse, so that's really good. I have my virtual grad at seven. It's currently 618. So I need to get ready for that soon. I'm just going to wear this. I just changed it to a sweater because I was absolutely freezing. I'm going to put the top coat on these nails, seal them in, and then I'll see what we get up to next. Okay guys, so Victoria here with a little update. Caitlin is trying to ride the ripstick. Oh, oh you're doing it! Okay, don't slow down, don't slow down. Oh. Caitlin, you're gonna ruin your nails, bro. I know, I'm kinda scared of it. I can't close this gate. I'll close it. Oh no, oh no. You're being a goofy. Nope. You can't. Two hours later. It is almost 8.30 and I think I'm gonna post on Instagram. This is probably the latest I've ever posted, but everyone's posting about graduation and things, so I kinda want to as well. I just thought it'd be fun.
my room is a complete mess honestly today was very chaotic and now my room is a mess so I'm gonna clean it and you guys are gonna get a little montage of me cleaning my room A few moments later. Okay guys, I just showered so that is why I look a little bit like a mess. But I'm just currently doing my schoolwork. This is the last project that I have to do for high school, which is actually kind of crazy to think that once this is handed in, like I'm literally done. It was a very chaotic day and this always happens on these days of like family barbecues and things. I want to balance filming but also spending time with family and just having fun. I'm going to finish this project tonight, hand it in. Okay guys, it is now the end of the vlog. I just wanted to hop on here and talk about my high school experience. For me personally, high school was honestly, I'm not gonna lie or sugarcoat it. It was not the experience that I wanted. I went into high school so excited to meet new people, so excited to join things, more social life. I've always been a very introverted person. It's not what I wanted it to be. A lot of it stems back to what happened in grade nine. If you have seen any of my videos, you would know that I went through an eating disorder, which was a big thing for me. It was a huge struggle and it lasted my grade nine year, my grade 10 year, and I think even some into my grade 11 year. I believe that it truly set me back in my high school. I didn't really hang out with friends much. I didn't do any clubs. I didn't get involved. I did meet my best friend, which was really cool. And I'm glad that it happened because it was the one time where I actually put myself out there. Looking back, I regret not being more outgoing. When I went into high school, I already had friends going in so it made it really easy for me to just stay in my circle and not bridge out the friends i had were great they really supported me especially in my time of struggle i wish my high school experience was much more social and that i actually did things if you guys are going into grade nine i know everyone says this but literally just get out do things go to social events like do all those things because if you don't you will regret it fully life is like moving so fast i never thought i'd be here graduated from grade 12 like, i am trying to be more outgoing and do more things i'm really excited to go to college so that i can have a college life i'm planning on going to a college near me for working with children i want to become a daycare worker but also now that I've started this YouTube channel, I've gained a lot more interest in different things and it's kind of weird because I know that I have my life planned out and I know what I want to do. I've thought of so many other jobs that I'm like, why didn't I do that? Why didn't I go for that? I would love to go for all these jobs. I have learned from doing YouTube that I'm really into like brand marketing and like learning about how brands work and how like PR packages work and it's so cool to learn how brands promote their products to get people to buy them so i think that's a really cool job and i would honestly love to do that i've also thought about like why didn't i try something like acting when i was a kid i did acting a lot for my church they put on like plays for the youth group and i loved doing that i loved the acting and reading the scripts and doing all that 
those things. So I'm like, why didn't I do that? I'm thinking of all these jobs, but like, I don't know what to do because one, I don't think I have the educational requirements to go to either of those jobs. And two, I can't do all three. So it's kind of weird. I need to figure out what I'm doing. I really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below to become a member of this channel. I'm really excited because we are almost at 400. We are at 386 subscribers now, which is insane. I'm so excited to be growing and to have this channel to document my life. I love you guys so much. Make sure to follow me on all my socials. They'll be in the description box below. I post on my Instagram so much, so definitely follow there so you can see my day-to-day -day life. Turn my bell notification on. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.